In this short video, we're going to look at how you create policies for the runtime of all of your environments inside of your Team Labs account and for your entire team. A policy determines how long an environment runs for, when it is deleted, and what to do when a user is inactive in an environment. The reason you create policies is so that you can reclaim resources to use for other environments, which allows you to, for example, run a very large environment one day and many small environments another. To create a policy, simply go to the Management menu, click on Policies. You will see a list of all of your policies and how often they're used. Now click Create Environment Policy. Give the policy a name. The runtime lease is how long the environment will run before it suspends. So for this policy, I'm going to say eight hours. The storage lease is how long the environment will last before it deletes. So I'm going to make this one seven days. The environment inactivity handling is how you determine what to do when a user is inactive inside of an environment. Best practice is to suspend the environment after some period of time. I'm going to turn this to 30 minutes. What I've created here is an environment policy that will allow an environment to run for eight hours a day for, and then delete after seven days. Perfect policy for a work week. I have also said that if the user is inactive for 30 minutes, the environment will suspend. So if a user goes off to lunch, the environment will automatically suspend. Now click Create. Now you can see that I have created my new policy that can be used on all newly created environments or environments run from Blueprints.